Hi everyone, I hope you are having a great weekend and I wanted to come back today to do a Daiso haul and I hope all of you will enjoy this haul. Uh, it does consist of a lot of Halloween items. I did a Daiso haul earlier in September which was mainly from August and I didn't get to film until September. So this haul is really what I picked up in the last uh, couple of weeks and I was especially excited to find the Halloween items last weekend because when I went back this weekend some of the things that I got were gone so uh, they sure do go fast and one of the things that was the most popular let's start off with Halloween are their washi tapes so I went ahead and got all the designs that uh, I can find and I'm glad I did because I went to check back uh, this weekend and they were all gone so I found seven designs and I believe there was an eighth one but I couldn't find that one I'm going to try another store maybe next weekend and see if I can see it but um, so far these were the ones that I could find so the first one right here has the Frankenstein and the witch and the jack-o-lanterns and then this one here has uh, also Frankenstein and it looks like a vampire and ghost so I thought these designs are so cute so I don't know if you can really see it through the plastic but anyway I thought they were fun and then this one has these different uh, sayings it says eek and then it has some borders on it so hopefully you guys can see that it has different sayings on each of them and then this one's really cute too this one has the witch and the jack-o'-lantern with the speech bubbles and then this one has the witch and the ghost looking out the window as well I think there was another one that was similar to this but um, I couldn't find it so I only got this one and then I got this design right here with the ghost jack-o'-lantern and skeleton and then I got this one so they had these designs and then the last one that I got was this one which came in a roll like this. So let me just turn it around to show you guys. Super fun. So I love it because their designs are completely different from the Dollar Tree designs. So I just had to get them all. I hope I can find one more design next weekend. I will try. Um, if not, I was very happy to find these because if I waited a weekend didn't go until this weekend I wouldn't have been able to find any of those tapes um some other Halloween items that I got I got this Halloween cookie cutter set and doesn't this totally remind you of Batman that is so cute and I also got this one with the silhouette of a ghost so this came in a set I also got a box of these uh wax paper and it comes in kind of like the ghosts and jack-o'-lantern prints and the bats. I think you guys can kind of see that. I also got a set of these, um, they, I guess they call them paper lunch cups, five pieces of them. But I think I might use them for projects instead. So they have different faces on them. So one of them has Frankenstein, one of them has the ghosts and the black cat. And it looks like there's also a mummy and jack-o'-lantern. So I thought these were really cute. So I got a set of those. And again, everything from Daiso is $1.50 unless otherwise marked. But I mainly stick to the items that are $1.50. I also got some treat bags. I didn't pick up a whole lot. They had so many cute designs. But because I got some at Dollar Tree already, I didn't want to go crazy at Daiso. I got the big ones, which um, have the base at the bottom so it's quite big so this one only comes in a pack of three but look how cute the patterns are again it has like who makes the ghosts that cute look at that who does that and then look at the jack-o-lantern and i love how the words in happy halloween are just so colorful so much fun and then the other pack i got was uh the 16 counts of the clear one and it also has these little ghosts floating around as well so I thought that was really cute. And then the last Halloween item that I got was this banner right here. Again, I don't really go crazy on the decorating for Halloween. I try to keep it as simple as possible. But I did think that this was quite cute. And it's it kind of looks kind of crafty-like, vintage-like. 
so I thought that would be really nice to hang and they had a lot of other decorations and um, pumpkins that I didn't even pick up I didn't want to go too crazy but I was excited to find those items for the Halloween and now let's uh, move on to a couple of houseware items I got this colander uh, that is foldable because I think it's very it saves a lot of space and so I can pop it up like this to use in the kitchen when I'm washing things but when I'm done it's collapsible so I can fold it back like this to hang so it doesn't have to be sticking up at the bottom but I got it in the pink I think it came in different colors and I didn't even realize this when I got it but when you look at the drain right here the little holes it's like a they're like smiley faces prints right so I thought this was really good to use for my kitchen and I also got this a car freshener. I actually picked this up before and I wanted to get another one because I'm done using the one um, that's currently in my car. So I'm just going to go ahead and replace this. But let me take off the rabbit. It's very cute. It looks like a mini garbage can. And I it, this fits perfectly in the cup holder of my car. So I just go ahead and leave it in there. It does smell quite nice. I also got this, you guys. This is so cute. This is a miniature garbage can, and it has the strawberry print on it. I just thought this was so cute. This is great to put on the table, and I just thought it was adorable. So I just had to get that. And then a couple of decor items. I got this ceramic panda piggy bank and this was the last one that they had I saw a lady basically fill her basket with over a dozen of them I'm not sure what she's using them for probably as gifts I'm assuming but she must really like pandas as well I would pick up more if, uh, if I could but this was the last one and I'm glad it wasn't broken so she, at least she left one on the shelf right jeez <laughs> but um I like how he's sitting like this so cute it's very adorable. I love pandas. So I just had to get that one. They usually have a lot of ceramic bangs, but I don't really pick them up. And I got this little uh, display. I don't I, I don't know what you call it. Maybe a little pedestal thing, but it looks like a log with some mushrooms on it. And this would be cute. If you had uh, um, any miniature figurines, you could put it and create like a forest theme. And I do have a little uh, bear that, or and a rabbit that I can probably put on here so I went ahead and got that this was also a dollar fifty um, a couple of beauty items and uh, not didn't go too crazy but usually what I like to pick up at Daiso are the makeup wipes so this is definitely one of my favorites this comes in a pack of 30 and this one is the it says it's, it has plenty of cleansing oil now there's no brand of course it's a Daiso brand but this is quite nice. I like it. And I think it's in the grapefruit scent, if I remember correctly. And then this one is in the cucumber scent. This one's also in a pack of 30. So I'm not sure which one I'll like better, but the Daiso wipes are pretty good. I and mean, I can feel that it's pretty moist just by feeling the packaging. So I'll see which one I like so that I can buy it again next time. I also went ahead and got this. I've never seen this before in my store. This is the Fragrant bouquet blooming jasmine nail cream so I thought this would be great especially in between um changing out the polishes nail polishes I think this would be great to put on just to keep um our nails healthy so I went ahead and got this to give it a try and it's in such pretty packaging too look at that and then the other item I got in the beauty section were these clips these are the antique type hair clips in the small size it comes in two pieces I like how it has the pink and gold combination I don't know if you guys can really see it I do apologize if there's any glare in the packaging but there's like a little tiara at the top and then these gemstones right here so I thought this was really cute to add as a hair accessory okay and then now on to the crafty and stationary items I did go crazy on like a lot of washi tapes that they had uh, but first of all I picked up this uh, pen so holder pen pencil holder look how pretty this is I absolutely love the Paris theme design last time I picked one up that was in the cream color this time I picked up the one in the pink this is just so pretty I love the romantic look to it so I went ahead and got that I also got two of these um, chalkboard 
easels. I thought they are really cute and I can definitely put my chalkboard markers to use and I have something in mind that I want to use this for but not only is it chalkboard on one side look the other side is actually a cork board so you can actually use um, both sides or utilize one side over the other like let's say if you put the uh, stands together one side you use the cork and one side you use the chalkboard I thought that would be really cute and that's why I went ahead and got two of these and these I think were still a dollar fifty each and then I got these handicraft decoration candy so these would be great for crafting to make um, paper clips to make cards uh, and you know put in shadow boxes to create a little piece of artwork but there's just so many things that you can do with these so I thought they were so adorable so they are kind of in the colored and the white stripes combination so I got this pack that has the pink and the mint green and then this one is the purple and the yellow striped ones so I got one of each pack of those again it comes in an eight count pack and then you guys, I went crazy on the washi tape, like I said. So they had a lot of new washi outside of the Halloween ones. So I went ahead and got this one that's kind of like the galaxy print and the birds. It just feels like you're in outer space. So how fun is that one? I also got this one right here. That's kind of like a French romantic like theme. And so you can kind of see it has these borders here. I do apologize for any glare, but I thought that was so cute. And then they had these thin ones. So I went ahead and got this one. It's like the yellow and black and white polka dot combination. Very, very cute. I also got this one with the penguins on them. I believe it's all penguins, but these have the penguins. I got this one that has like the forest theme on it. So you see like the bear, it looks like the raccoon, the deer, the fox, the owl. And uh, yeah, I just thought this was really, really cute. I hope you guys can see it okay. I do apologize for any glare again um, at your end. But here's another one of that version with the flowers and the borders, this is the thicker version. And then here's another one that is super cute. This one is like a summer theme one and you can see that it has like the socks and the shoes, the dress, the watch, the beach bag, umbrella, headset. So this is super fun, it has the shoes so I thought these washi tapes are super cute. And then two more designs of the tape. This one is like all stars. Very cute. I love the colors on this one. And then last but not least, this one has these bows on them. Look how pretty they are different color bows so you guys my washi collection is getting out of control but I love it I will keep getting it because there's so many things that you can do with the washi and then I got this um, this is not washi tape but this they call it printing cloth type tape so it's probably thick like a duct tape roll but I love this because it has these Japanese girls on them the Japanese in the kimonos so I thought these were really pretty. So I went ahead and got a roll. There's not a lot. So I want to see how these work compared to regular duct tape. I went ahead and got a roll of that one. And then in terms of some stationery, you guys, I thought these were adorable. These were new in my store. These are the uh, Cover and Hide Ice Cream Sticky Notes. So there, there were two designs. This is the first one right here that has kind of like the Neapolitan cover right here. And then there's the ice cream cone. And then the other one is kind of like this blue with some sprinkles on it and also the same ice cream pack. So I thought these were so cute. I went ahead and got two packs of those. And then uh, these were also new. These are the name stickers. These are kind of like labels. And I thought the designs were really cute as well. They come in like candy and hearts. And it says love. And you guys can see, I'll kind of show you guys the design. 
has the bows, the cupcake, the stars. Oh, you see that ice cream right there? Ice cream cone. So I thought these were cute. Uh, it comes in a pack of 26. And again, again, it's great to use in the journals. But because they only had one of design, uh, one of each design and not a lot in each pack, I went ahead and got two of those. And then I also got this letter set, you guys. This is like an egg. Who can make an egg so cute, right? So this was so fun. I do love eggs, eggs and toast, but of course they had to make it all kawaii and cute and everything. So I got this letter set right here. I thought this was a little different because a lot of times the letter sets that they have are usually filled with like animals or flowers. And who would think to make one with kind of like an egg and toast theme and make it this cute? So I got that, and it comes in, I don't know how many, I don't say it comes in eight sheets, but look at the top. It says, eat sunny side up eggs, which I do. I do love sunny side up eggs. So these are the stickers, and then these are the envelopes and the letters that go together. So I got that, and then they had a little bit more of these stationery, the Japanese paper stationery. They had a lot of other ones except this one. So I picked up the last ones that I could find. This one is like a note card and envelope set, and then this one's like the little paper bag set with the pandas. I just love his different poses. Look how cute. I really want to find another set of this, but I don't know why the panda stuff just gets sold out so quickly. So I was really happy to find, but look at all his poses. Look at him stretching. Look, look at that. Leaning back. He looked like he's trying to do some workout. Maybe it's panda yoga, right? <laughs> But anyway, it's really cute. So I went ahead and got that one and then the little version of it with, you know, his back facing us. And again, in all the different positions. And then uh, just some stickers, you guys. I've never seen these before. These are the Puffy Fun stickers. And it comes in kind of like a foil material. I just thought these were so cute. And Daiso doesn't have a whole lot of stickers. So that's why I was excited to find these. And these are the different crowns. I also love the colors of that. And then I got this uh, pencil case or pen case. And it's kind of in this plastic material. But I thought it was so cute. It has the plaid design on the top. has this cute little bunny. And of course it has to have little mushrooms and macaroon designs on it. So I thought this was super fun. I went ahead and got that. And then the last item that I got from Daiso was this box of Pocky Coconut Flavor. Actually, I don't know if this is from Daiso or Ichiban Khan. Actually, you know what? I think this is from Ichiban Khan. So um, I love Pocky and this is in the coconut flavor. So I wanted to give this a try. This was new in the store. And then I only picked up a few items from Ichiban Khan. I got two of these pads right here, which they look like origami paper, but they're actually, they call them design papers. I really like the retro look of this one. So this one looks like it's like a map of a city. So I kind of like the dimensions to that very unique and then um and then this one right here is like the musical notes i don't know if you guys can see it focus 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 so yeah, i know you guys can't see it too well but i thought these ones the designs were really cute and it has kind of like an antique theme to it and it comes in a stack of like 48 of them which i thought was a great deal and then this one also is the letter set, but it has these strawberry prints on them. So I thought that was super cute. And then last but not least from Ichiban Khan, just picked up one roll of tape. Gosh, I didn't even check back with them to see if they have any Halloween stuff. If not, I would probably go even more crazy. But here's the one. It says for you and thank you very girly and fun so I went ahead and got that so that is my Daiso and quick Ichiban con haul I hope you all enjoyed this and I was really excited to find all the Halloween items so if you have a Daiso in your area go ahead and check out your Daisos and uh, let me know what you've seen in your stores lately I'd love to see all of your hauls as well from Daiso because it definitely is a very unique store so thank you so much for watching you guys I will be back soon with more haul videos and look forward to talking to you all again soon have a great one bye